Hello everyone. Today we are going to be looking at the Common Core Standard in third grade math that says relate area to the operations of multiplication and division. So first we are going to start with looking at just counting our squares in a rectangle or square when we are trying to find the area. So right now I'm just writing area on the paper to get a little excited because finding the area of the figure is very exciting. So now I'm starting to draw the rectangle for my figure and each figure that I draw is going to be a four by two figure. So that means I have four squares going across and it's two squares down. So right now I'm taking a different colored marker and I'm going to count each square. So let's count them one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So my area is eight square units. Don't forget the label, that's very important when you are working with area, perimeter, or volume. So any type of measurement. So now we are going to try using multiplication. I find that multiplication can be the quickest way to find the area of a figure. So once again, we have that four by two square here, and I think four by two is equal to eight if I can use my rote memory. If not, I can use my skip counting and do two, four, six, eight and get the same answer. So once again, we have a figure that is eight square units. For the last square rectangle that we look at here, it is again going to be a four by two square, but this time we can practice our addition skills when doing this as well. When we found um, the first square when we counted two, that could be thought of as using addition as well, but right here, we are going to again get the four by two square and I chose to do two plus two plus two plus two. You could also do four plus four and get the same answer. Once again, we reach eight square units. Thank you so much for joining today. We were able to find and use this standard to help us find area using different ways. Make sure you use a strategy that is best for you. Thank you so much for watching.